Oh, we got us again. So the problem is that he's spinning around us too fast. So he's not actually facing us or in front of us. So let's fix that. That's part of his AI. So we'll go to the enemy AI. We're just going to set a public int, we'll say min distance. Let's call it max distance. Now this is going to be the maximum distance he'll be away from you before he starts moving towards you. So in the start function, we're just going to say max distance is equal to uh, 2. Now remember he's going to attack at 2.5. So an update, we'll keep looking at us, but he's not going to move unless his distance is uh, greater than 2. So if vector3 distance, our target's distance, our target's trans, well actually our target is a transform here, so we just do target position and our position, which we have cache. So my transform not position is greater than max distance. So let's save that off. Are we sure we don't have any errors? And let's try it out. So if he gets within two, he should stop. There we go. He attacked us, he attacked us, he attacked us, and we can attack back. All right. So we have our small little combat system in place. So next week we'll work on a targeting system that allows us to have multiple enemies in the scene and we'll be able to target through each one. Till then, have fun.